So now let's add the distillation column that we need. The first one is the rat frac, which is one of the most complete or most detailed columns, especially for distillation columns. So we will need the number of stages total, the number in which we will be adding the feed, the type of uh, condenser, which is partial evaporator, the distillate rate, which will be 20 kmol per hour, the reflux rate, which is 5 molar, that is 5 is going back to the column, whereas 1 is going up as a product. And the operation pressure will be 1.95 bar. So we assume there is no pressure drop. Let's go here. Mixers. No, we need to go to the column tab at the rat frac, which is here. And you can choose between all these units right here. I'm pretty sure that we want to add the standard column. So let's add this as column one. Let's bring this here. And we know it needs one fit and at least two products. One rows here. Let me name this one as fit number two because it's going to the second column. And let me add this as, I don't know, boil ups or let's say distillate one. Now we need to input the data. As you can see here, we have mostly everything okay but the column. So let's double click the column. And first things first, we need to add this as an equilibrium operation, the number of stages are 15. The condenser was a partial vapor. That, that is, we are recirculating or we have reflux of the vapor. The reboiler is okay kettle. Valid phases, of course, are both. And let's go to the distillate rate. Will be molar, 20 mol per hour. Reflux ratio, as stated, 5. Streams, we need to state the feed stream, which is the eighth stage. Okay, vapor is going to be 1, liquid is going to be 15, that's fine. Now we need to state a pressure. We can add a pressure profile, section, pressure drop, or simply add an overall pressure state. So I'm going to assume there is not dropping pressure. So by doing this, the column will be stated as 1.95 bar. Condenser, it's okay, you don't need to state any temperature. Reboiler, it's okay, you don't need to state anything. So let's go to the main flow sheet and run this. Hopefully everything goes fine and as stated, no errors. That's awesome.